Hello everyone, Rob Talk here with another blog. Um, this time I'm actually going to be talking about games that I own. I wish I had uh, some sort of uh, cover for them that I could find online. Fortunately, the site that I go to d doesn't have any covers for any video games. Only movies. Drats. So I don't want to take any time trying to look for a website. So let's just uh, get this started. Uh, actually, before I start naming my video games, I actually want to say that um, yeah, this is going to be dedicated for naming my PlayStation games, like PlayStation 1 and 2. I don't have any of my PlayStation 3 games here with me at the moment because they're being borrowed along with my PlayStation 3. My brother is borrowing it, plus the game, so yeah. So here we go. First game for the PlayStation 2, 007, Everything or Nothing. To me, and a lot of people on YouTube actually agree with me that this is the best James Bond game ever to this date. Don't get me wrong, they've made some, some very good ones. They have. But a lot of people on YouTube actually agree with me on this. I've, I've seen a lot of their videos. 007, everything or nothing. Um, can I give you any description? Kind of. With everything at stake, the world calls on Bond. James Bond. Uh, that's all for the description. Alright, moving on. 24, the game. Now, I did, um, I did a video walkthrough of this a while back on GamingOne.com. And, um, I got a good amount of views for it. So I would say that people, my viewers also like this game. They like uh, watching me play it. Uh, and it's based off of the hit, hit TV series 24. Which, uh, the game... The storyline of the game actually takes place between season 2 and season 3. I like to call, call it season 2.5. Anyhow. Next one is Dragon Quest 8 for the PlayStation 2. Um, it's a good game. I wouldn't say it's bad, I wouldn't say it's very good, but it's good. It's a uh, RPG. For King and Country, uh, we have a description here. A vast and vibrant world is yours to explore in the latest installment of this legendary role-playing series. A mysterious jester, a forbidden scepter, a fiendish cross, a once idyllic kingdom lies entangled in a web of enchanted vines, its king and princess hideously transformed, its castle and subjects frozen in time. Only one person has survived this horror unscathed. You. Only you can save your king and country by lifting the shadow of evil Jesus' course. But it won't be easy. An epic tale of friendship, bravery, and adventure awaits you on the grassy fields, snow-caped mountains, and restless seas of Dragon Quest VIII. Wow. Uh, my best, the best Dragon Quest game that I've ever played is not this one. This is eight. The best one that I've ever played will have to be four. I'm, I'm a bit of a fan of Dragon Quest, but not much. Not a big fan of Dragon Quest, Dragon Warrior games. Okay, moving on. ETV Off World Fury. Okay, I haven't tried this yet. Uh, I bought it not too long ago. Half the people told me it's it's really good. And other people have told me 
It's awful. It's bad. You shouldn't play it. Okay. Continuing on. Gran Turismo 3. A spec. Okay. Another one that I haven't played yet. I tend to play in the future. Maybe do a walkthrough of it. Um, everyone has told me. Ah, picture changed. Everyone has told me that uh, it's actually a good game. A good racing game. Um, I forgot to mention ATV Off of Fury is also a racing game. Gotta remember to say that stuff. Racing RPG action type thing, yeah. Next game is another one I haven't played, of course, but I bought it not too long ago. Jumpo Griffin's Story. Anywhere is possible. Um, I haven't heard anything about this game, and uh, I want to try it. it. It's based off the movie Jumpo. Some most games when they're based off movie off of movies or TV shows, they tend to be bad, but some games actually stand out, like the Twenty Four game. So. Uh, to Toy Story game, the, the, the first one, actually stood out. Anyhow, let's continue. I have so many games out, so many. Medal of Honor Frontline. I started playing this a few days ago. It's actually good so far. I have played about two hours in it. I'm actually looking forward to the rest of the game. It's a shooting game. Sokum 2 US Navy SEALs. There's another shooting game for the PlayStation 2. And uh, I haven't tried it yet. I, I bought it not too long ago. Another one. Yeah. I bought a few not too long ago. Uh, like a month, maybe a little bit less, maybe a little bit more. They were kind of like a package deal. Sokum US Navy SEALs Combined Assault for the PlayStation 2, another action game, and I have not tried it, like the last one I just said. Okay, next one is one of my all-time fav one of my all-time favorites on the PlayStation 2, uh, and it's an RPG game, role-playing ga game, and it's Final Fantasy X. It's a really good game. I have to agree with my brother. It is a little bit of a letdown compared to other Final Fantasies that came out before this one. But I still love it. It was it was the same thing with my brother. Yeah, he loved it, but he he's he found that it was a little bit of a letdown. Anyhow, continuing on. Final Fantasy 7 for PlayStation RPG game. Um, there's actually one of my most favorite games of all time, which is my top 10. Yep. Uh, moving on. This next game, I like it. I don't love it. I don't hate it. Guitar Hero 2. It's a good game. You need... You need the guitar uh, for the PlayStation 2 to um, play it if you if you have it for the PlayStation 2 if you have it for the Xbox or the 360 something like that forget which one it came out on but the one that came out on um, you need the guitar for that console and the guitar for the PlayStation 2 will not work on any other console I've learned that the hard way. Egg. Okay, next one. Another one of my PlayStation 2 favorites. It's a wrestling game. And it's WWE Smackdown vs. Raw 2006. It's not the best one. It's not the best wrestling game that they've ever made. The best wrestling game that they ever made would have to be Smackdown. WWE Smackdown Here Comes the Pain 
which I no longer own because it broke on me. Egg. Okay, um, that's going to be it for this time. Uh, join me for the next part. I do some more games. What? There's more? Yeah, I have lots. Stay tuned.